Hey everybody, Mike here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a new video. So, um, in the last video, I asked you guys to send in requests, right? And I received a request to explain how to change your wireframe color and also how to render out your wireframe, okay? Not that difficult, actually. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna set up a quick scene. We'll grab some objects. Uh, we'll do a, a sphere, a cube, and a cylinder. Let's uh, move them out a little bit. Let's take this guy, move it out here, take our cube, make it a bit bigger, and move it out a little bit. And I guess that's fine, yeah. Just turn on my grid for a second so I can see what's going on, and we'll grab all of this and we'll move it up like that, okay. Now, let's say I want my wireframes to be white. Now, I just like them, you see by default they're green, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select all of these. I'm gonna go up to mesh and combine first. So if I change one, I change all, yeah? Next thing I wanna do is go up to display. We're gonna to go to, where is it? Wireframe color, we're gonna click on that. We're gonna change index to RGB. Click on that black right there, and I want it to be white, okay? So click on white, there you go. And then we'll click on apply and close. And now you're probably thinking, well, hey, it's still green. Well, just click outside of your object and then hit four for wireframe mode. And there you have it, okay? Now, um, this is what I want to be uh, you know, in my render. So I'm gonna turn off my grid right there. And I want the background to be completely black. So I'm gonna hold down Alt and hit a B. And there you go, completely black. From here, I can now go in, do something like this, and I can simply do a screen grab, right? I can do that. Of course, you don't wanna select it like that, so use a screen grab program. So from here on, I can do a screen grab. Just to drag select it and save that out as a file. Um, if you want, you can actually do a play blast as well if you have some animation going on. But that's how easy that is. So one, change the color of your wireframe, and two is simply to grab a screenshot of that, okay? Um, yeah, that's it guys. Uh, hopefully that's helpful. Let me know in the comments and let me know what else you wanna see in future videos. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.